Assalamu alaikum Welcome to Solid Boys Sheet Metal We have covered surfaces in this portion We're going to cover sheet metals So we're going to discuss a lot of commands But we're going to cover them one by one So let me start from the base plane So whenever you're going to create a sheet metal part You must need a base plane after that, you can add the edge flange and matter flange. But how can you use the base flange? Remember one thing, base flange is used to create the first wall. And after that, once you create the first wall, after that you can create the secondary walls. For that we are going to use the edge flange or matter flange. I will discuss uh, these commands in later videos. So let me start the video. Just come to base flange and here just choose a front plane. Okay, and let me draw a center rectangle like this. If you want, you can assign the dimension. Let me keep it 200 for now and let me keep this 150 and just exact sketch. Once you've done this, so here you, you, you should come here and from here you can assign the sheet metal thickness let me keep it 12 for now 12 is really maximum for now because sheet metals have not this much thickness but this is just for your understanding almost it is 1 or almost it is 2 not greater than because sheet metals come when the thickness of the slab or you can say that this the, the sheet metal thickness must be less than 5 millimeter you can just reverse direction from here by unchecking and check this box almost in sheet metals we are dealing with k factor and almost we're keeping it one must remember here you must come uh, here and you can either select rectangular either tier or either up around once you come to rectangular here you can assign the ratio 1.4 or something like okay so once you've done this, so this is how you can create the first wall inside SOLIDWORK sheet metal. Because first wall is really needed because you have to start up with the first wall after that you can do other what, what, what else, whatever you want you can do it up. You can add up the secondary walls and that is necessary to know about the base flange. Again I tell you that base flange is used to create the first wall. Once you've done the first wall you can add up the secondary vaults by using the edge flange and metal flange in later videos I will show you how can you do this and if you done something wrong you can just come to base flange just click on this and come to edit feature and okay you can just come here come here and you can just you can just edit them by from here okay this must be 12 okay and you can see here I have changed thickness from 2 to 12 so this is really under, uh, really very important for you uh, hopefully you understand how can you create the first wall inside solid worksheet metals and upcoming videos I will upload the, a lot of commands on sheet metals the remaining portion of the sheet metal how it is how it works and we really needed to use it so hopefully you enjoyed this video if you're new on my channel so please don't forget to like the video and also subscribe my channel for more interesting videos